Life's not fair, is it, my little friend? While some are born to feast, others spend their lives in the dark. Is this the one everyone thinks is hot? Because I know there's one lion where everyone's like, yeah, that's the hot one. And I've been told you're not a real Lion King fan unless you've got a crush on the lions. But like, no, no, that's not my life. That's not for me. Though, to be fair, to be realistic here, he does have some nice physical features. Like he's got the scar, which is cool, right? That's awesome. That's his identity. That's who he is, right? Like, who do you think he was before the scar? You can't just call a lion perfect skin, even if he has it, which he does. But anyway, moving on, he's got a beard too, right? Like, look at that. I, I don't even think that's realistic. Do lions even have beards? He rocks that beard. I have no problem with his beard. And he's got like, oh, look at that beautiful character design right there. He's got like that little, little notch in his ear, right? I approve of the notch. It's super cute and I love it. But not in that way. Just in a normal, strictly platonic, he's a lion way. Just to be clear. Moving on. Yeah, no, 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 no. He's even less hot in daylight. But you know what I do like here? Again, that ear, that ear. Focus on that ear. Don't focus on not this, not these hyenas in the background. Focus on them in your own time. Watch it. For scraps. Oh, it wiggles. It wiggles so much. I love the ear twitch. That ear has more character than any other character in this film so far. And this scene right here uh, summarizes my experience watching late night television. I theoretically know one of these is John Oliver, but like which one? They're all birds, I can't even tell. Everything you see exists together in a delicate balance. Can you imagine it? 2019 Disney making us watch a live action lion eating a live action bug. I mean, I know it's not live action. It's just animation, but different, but still gruesome and disgusting. Like on the one hand, I can't wait for it. But on the other hand, neither will my lunch. I know, I know people are complaining about this film, right? They're complaining about the live action. They're complaining about how can this lion possibly have the character and expression of the original? And to you complainers, maybe you have a point, but I would like to tell you about this bird right here. Get a load of this bird. Zazu is undeniably looking better in this film than ever before. His beak is on point. His tail is on point. His whatever this neck is is on point. He's such a pointy boy. I would trust him with my life. I would trust him to open packages too. Mostly to open packages. While others search for what they can take, a true king searches for what he can give. There's some meaning in this shot. Too deep, with too many layers, and too many complications for me to possibly understand and comprehend, but I'm gonna unpack it for you all anyway, because I think I can do this it, right here. That's Simba. Clearly, he's jealous of his father. Jealous of those, uh, massive toe beans. Like, trust me, I know someone who knows someone who owns a cat, and it's all about the beans. It's all about those toe beans. Watch out for them. It's all about the beans. It's all about the beans. Run away, Simba. And never return. <laughs> Oh no, that's not hot. That's super mean. He can't just do that. Although, although you know what is super cute? Look at how fast he is. He runs so fast. The lowest effort Hakuna Matata I have ever seen. Imagine if I auditioned for the part of a warthog because like, that's how it works, right? And I dance the way he dances, not even dancing. I would be rejected. How did he ever get this part? I don't know. Every 2019 film needs an animal courtship scene by law. I don't make the rules. It's just how things work. And uh, who is this? Is that Lion Beyonce? I mean, I know she has a lion name, but I'm a fake fan. I don't know what it is. I forgot it. Honestly. Just call her Lion Beyonce. 
that's what we're all going to think of her as. And it's super memorable. You got Simba and you got Lion Beyonce. It's great. Oh, yeah. Super hot. Look at that stare. Oh, yeah. Also really hot. You know they're feeling the love tonight because they're like 20 feet away from each other on this watering hole. Yeah, that's sexual tension. I can just, I can't handle it. I can't handle this. This is too much for me. You must take your place. And the circle of life. Now, I'm not going to say Simba's hot. Because he's not. And I want to make that clear. But if there ever were a hot lion in this entire film, this would be the one. Lion Beyonce, you chose well. You chose well, Lion Beyonce.